A technique used to model wear and tear on buildings, or the impact of a car crash, is now being used to better understand how animals kill their prey. Stephen Rowe and his team have been using a process called finite element analysis to model animal skulls. They scan a skull to get a 3D digital image, from which they create maps of its surface. Then, they use software to model how stresses, like the jaw and teeth biting into flesh, affect the skull as a whole. The team's model of a great white shark skull revealed that its jaws can withstand a bite force equivalent to 1.8 tons. Although this is a powerful bite, it's weaker than expected. Other models are giving insight into the killing power of extinct species. The Tasmanian tiger was wiped out from the Australian mainland 3,000 years ago. Rowe and his team created this visualization, which shows that its skull could not handle biting large prey. But when they analyzed the skull of a dingo, they found that its head and neck were well built for tackling large animals. This could explain why it survived when prey was scarce, whereas the Tasmanian tiger didn't. In the future, the team will look at the bite of early humans. By modeling feeding habits, they hope to get insight into why some ancient humans died out, whereas our own lineage survived.